It's been a while since I shiny hunted. Like, I've been doing raids off and on, just like in my free time. By the way, this is Peekaboo. I got him back in like August. He's still a Bagon. I am going to eventually evolve him into a Salamence. Right now, he's still a Bagon, but it's kind of been a while since I shiny hunted. The question is, what do I want to go for? Let's see. What do we have? We could go for Zora or Zoroark, because that's a shiny I've been meaning to get for a while. Let's see. What do we have here? Yeah, the Crown Tundra has been out for just about a year, and I did say one of the first Pokemon I wanted to shiny hunt was Tortuga. Now, the very first one I got was Tyrant, but I did mention I wanted a shiny Tortuga. Who has better stats? One, two, three, four. One, two. You it is. Fizzy, you can just, you can just sit right down there. And of course, we have a bunch of open boxes to just stick a whole bunch of Tortuga eggs and uh, hope for the best in, right? Life goes on and 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 on. Y'all like Oliver Tree? Please tell me somebody out there likes Oliver Tree and it's not just me vibing in my room listening to the same songs over and over. I mean, somebody watching this is gonna like it, right? Right. Egg me. Alright, at this point I've got a few boxes full of eggs, so let's go ahead and hatch them and see if we actually have anything early on. Or if this is going to end up being a long hunt. Shiny tier two go, baby. Okay, so this was from last night. I was just lying in bed, hatching the eggs. I didn't think she would show up that fast, but he did. So I still have the rest of the eggs to hatch, being the ones that are here, and nope, that's it. Okay, so I just still have these left to hatch. Also, I named him Squirt after the turtle from Finding Nemo. I thought that was appropriate, given the fact that it's going to be staying a tier two go. So let me hatch the rest of the eggs, then we'll check them out in Pokemon Camp. So here he is, this is Squirt the Shiny Tortuga. He's got four, almost five perfect stats. As you can see, he's an atom in nature, and uh, there he is. Like I said, I am gonna keep him a Tortuga, Tortuga. I'm not evolving him, just because I really prefer the colors on Shiny Tortuga instead of Caracosta. So I'm gonna go ahead and put him in the first slot in our party. We can hang out with him in Pokemon Camp, and then that'll be the end of the video. Also, hi, you can see me, how you doing? Look at them, they're so tiny. Look at them go! And then of course we have Talonflame here, because Talonflame just always has to be in one of these videos. Hello? There he is, he's so pretty. Hello. Can you go fast? Also, let me, let me move you a little bit. Ooh, he's going. There you go. Here he comes. Here comes the boy. Hello, boy. Also, my mom is playing music in the living room, so at first in the earlier clips, I don't think you could hear it that much. I don't know if it's any louder than it is now. Hello, look at you! Where's the thumbnail? You're so cute. How are you doing? Well, I did just hatch you here, so let's make you some curry real quick. You need to eat. You haven't eaten anything. It's very pretty. Also, now that it's October, it's about time we start doing some spooky hunts. I do have a whole list of ghosts and dark type Pokemon that I've always wanted as a shiny, but I've just never gotten around to hunting, like Zora and Zoroark, as I mentioned earlier in the video. There's also Cophagrigus, there's also Lunarigus. We've got Mimikyu. I think I might go for Mimikyu this year, because I think last year I was planning on hunting it on Halloween, and then I just never did. So I think the next shiny I'm going to go after is going to be a Coffee Grigus, and then towards the end of the month we'll go after Mimikyu, that way we can have a nice spooky shiny that's a bit closer to Halloween. Yeah, I think a burger is safe enough for a little baby turtle to eat. He's floating. He floats. But that's going to be all for now. If you enjoyed, don't forget to drop a like and subscribe so you don't miss any more Pokemon videos or Genshin Impact videos. We're gonna say bye to Squirt real quick before we end the video, wherever he went. Hello, there he is. So I hope you all have a fantastic October. Good luck on all of your spooky shiny hunts if you decide to do one. 
Thank you all very much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.